Hey guys, Chris Birch here. Uh, today I just wanted to go and show you another item that we traditionally do um, in our print business, which is these door hangers, right? Traditional uh, political door hangers. Some people even use them for landscaping, tree experts, whatnot. So if you want to learn how we produce them here in house, stay tuned. Uh -huh. All right, so we just printed these out. As you see here, it's just blank. I mean, excuse me, blank at the top where the hole will be cut. So we're just going to back trim this last stack. And we're doing, this order is uh, 500 pieces. So now we're over here at the cutter. I'm going to make this one last trim. All right, so now they're all even. I'll take you over and show you how the hole and then the splice gets cut. So what I did not mention is actually when we print these door hangers, as you see here, there's more than one on the sheet. So for a four inch by nine inch, which is what we're doing today, four inches by nine inches, we actually are able to produce six of them on each printed sheet. And then as you just saw, we take our guillotine cutter and trim that down. So then you're, you're you're you end up with individual pieces. Now this job that we're doing today is only 500 pieces. Uh, it's a small local um, school board race, and in larger quantity we would use what's called a letter press, where it would the the device would actually take this piece, bring it up, and punch the hole. Uh, automatically. So with the smaller quantity we actually use what is right here if you can see it's just a single hole so you can take a couple pieces right take your punch and then bam you got a hole and because it's such a small order we just take regular scissors clip it and now, bam, you have a custom, full-color door hanger. So to learn more about this, uh, if you're interested in door hangers, I'll put a link down below. If this content has brought value to show you how we're able to produce door hangers, uh, do me a favor, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I'll talk to you guys soon.